was big. Mr. Morris. Hello, John. Can I wake you up? Yes. Oh, sorry. I don't know when the best time. I thought I'd leave it. Um, where? What's that? Oh, yeah. She, uh, uh, Mary Ann said you were up there mowing the lawn when I rang earlier. She said ring after four o'clock. So, yeah. so. Yeah, she said you were up. Oh, uh, uh, okay. Yeah, I'm coming down that way. You coming down? Uh, my sister to Oh, yeah. Huh? Oh, okay. Oh, okay, so, so, so you, you're coming down to go and see? Oh, I see, I see. Okay. Uh, well, Kingy's on his last legs too. He's taking his last breath at the moment. Yeah, my daughter's been telling me to give me a running commentary, commentary, and his, his family, his many family booted her out. I said, no, you just tell them you're, 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 you're his wife. You see, because... Eh? Hey? Kingy's family, he's got two wives or three wives, and they were all at the hospital, bombarded the whole place, and, and they told her to piss off. Yeah, my daughter to piss off, and I told her, right, you, you, you go and see the... Yeah, in uh, Middleborn. He won't. He didn't want to see me because he didn't want to. He he he, he didn't want me there. And I said to my daughter, tell him if he wants to see me. But he didn't want to. But he didn't want to see anybody. But but he 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 uh, he um, uh, the, the the nurses told her that he's on his last legs. He's hanging on. But uh, uh, Waitea Radio has been up there to see him and, and all that. They know that he hasn't got long to go. But he's, he's trying to hang on. So that's been a highlight of, of the... Yeah, he rang me up this morning. He rang me up this morning, Puro. And he says, well, how's your health, dear? I said, well, my health is all right. I've been managing all right, but... You know, he just wanted to poke his nose in because there's, he knows there's something going on. And then Willie rang me the night before. And he said, oh, we got a meeting on down in Whakatoa here, down in Apodiki, and I and like, oh, go to it. And I said, no, I'm, I'm not going to it. Uh, I'm, not, I'm not going to any more meeting. I haven't got time to go to any more meeting. So uh, uh, I'm not interested anymore in what they're doing. Because things are not going that way. That that's why. Yeah. Yeah. So. Uh, Pody, po po Pody, yeah. Yeah, so that's it's 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 a feud battle between what Pody is saying, which is closer to the truth, than what Porterho and them are doing, uh, and they don't want to hear what he's saying. They don't want to hear anything of what Pody is saying, but. Pody's on his own waka now. 
they're, they're all splitting off. Kingy's gone now, so they're in, in a big mess. You see, they don't want to, they don't trust each other. And even Reuben, Reuben Hey Hey, uh, they, they are on a different path from the Ratna. So, yeah, that's right. Keep right away. Keep right away from the bugger. Yeah, that, 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 it looks like, it looks, yeah. It looks like they wanted me. Yeah. Yeah. But they can't talk that sort of language in the British side. They can't do that. They, they have to hang into what they know, and that's about it. It goes nowhere. Yeah. Yeah. Yes. Yeah, so. Yeah, you better to do it. Yeah, I will go. Yeah. Well, you. Yes. So you you better to come down because I tell you what, I better better to do it now because I'm going back to Philippines. Because of of the tidal turbines, of, of, they want the Brahma thing in the water there now to get the money. So yeah, that's why. That's I've sent them the business plans to Thailand. Thailand wants to put the money in and get it going there, and Philippines. So I'm going back to go and kick the thing off. And it's only a plane ride. The fare is only five hundred one way, and then I just jump on a plane and then come back. It's it's not costing much now. But I'm, but I'm going to keep uh, keep uh, I'm setting up the thing so I can communicate with you from there. I'm going to take the the Wi-Fi booster because the signal's no good. It just cuts out where we are, where we are in the back blocks. I'm in the bloody back blocks, and that's why nothing can get out very much. But my in the uh, Philippines on one of the outer islands. I'm not I'm not in Manila where 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 all the business. I'm in the back where the sugar canes are. Right where, where the where the biggest sugar sugar cane in the world is up there where the, where the bamboo I'm going to make a house out of bamboo for us it's cheaper to build, build a bamboo house it don't whether don't care whether the rain comes through the roof it, it, because it's dry out in no time because it's warm but the thing is I know the they'll put the money behind it and then I'll have money for us you see because. Uh, even my mate in in, uh, in California with uh, with the King William, he's pushing the flag over there as well. He's doing all right uh, with his land with his land block there, and so I'm keeping it with King George the Third over there and King William the Fourth over there. The the Trump is looking at it. That's his mate, you see. So I'm trying to get the flag going to go and boot these ones here. As soon as I get the money, I'm back to boot these ones here into court. And cook. They can't do anything. They're, they're, they're law strapped. They, they can't because all their documents are Maori. You just won't get anywhere. They, even Sunakura, they're going down to Apodiki because Sunakura, they're all the Maori government, all those people. That's where Poro, they're all going down there thinking that that's where the answer is. With, with Jim Week or two. Yeah. Uh, I said, no, I'm going to bloody Philippines. I've had enough of you. I've had enough. I can't get anywhere with you while well, I'm not listening. So I'm going to someone outside that's listening and then bring them, a, get the money out of them to pay over here to get the flipping land back this way. You see, I can do your land from over there, but I want to go to the archives with you before I go next Thursday. The flipping air fares are cheap. That's why I had some money to pay for air fares to get back. And I, I got enough to get back. And wins, I'm going to wins tomorrow because they said, I have to sign a form if I'm going more than 26 days. That's why I had to get back. Because of winds. Winds, winds will cut my benefit. But if I tell them uh, I'm going there on a business thing, uh, then they'll let me have my, my, my pension while I'm there for longer than 26 weeks because that's all I'm allowed. 
yeah, yeah, yeah. They, 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 they said, no, you're right, but you've got to go and sign the papers. So I'm going in to sign the papers tomorrow. Take the ticket. I had to go and buy the ticket. And where are you going? Thursday. So we'll go to the archives before you go because I want to. I can clear that up from over there. I'm going over there till I get the money from the turbines because I've just written to Duterte and he could. Until I until I come back with my family. Yeah, I'm gonna I'm gonna go and see Duterte to give me the bloody immunity and diplomatic thing from over there to come back here with with the family and and and, and I'm gonna get on side with him. He'll put a gun out and shoot anybody in my road. That he, he he doesn't stand no nonsense. That guy, if he sees what I've got and it's to his benefit, he'll fucking shoot anybody in the road because he's using that. He's using that admiralty court martial law to kick Trump and, and the Americans out and the Rothschild bank out of there. So I'm going to drop the power note in front of him with that flag and tell him, right, here it is. You see, because that's where our trust is. All our money of Queen Victoria, is the gold is over there. He can't touch it because it belongs to the British. I'm going there to tell him, right, let's get it. There's, there's 1.7 million metric tons of gold over there and that's our trust. That's why I'm going there. I'm going to take the uh, I'm taking the flag with me, and I'm going to tell them right. Here's the flag that you're using for your court martial law to kick those people out. And here we're going to use it to get that gold in the ground because the British are subject to this flag. See, so so that's to our advantage. I wanted to tell you that because while I was there, I had no money to do any bloody thing. So I just had to sit there and and wait for the days to go past. But I enjoyed it. And, and the bloody heat got heat got to me, but yeah. No. Yeah, you can. Yeah. Yeah, and and I'll go too. Yeah, I'll go too. Yeah, I'll come with you for it. Yeah, I'll come. Yeah. Yeah, when, when, when is that? Friday or tomorrow or Monday? When? Oh, Sunday. Yeah, so, so if you come down on Sunday, just... Just let me know, and uh, and because it's Monday that uh, uh, that the uh, archives will open. I'll come down because I've got till yeah, Thursday. Yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. Well. Yeah. Well, you've got to make an appearance there. At least if you go there, you're there. So if not, then go go back. Yeah, but he wants to come back up here. And I said, no, no. He said, I'm picking with him. Take him back down there. Oh. I'm picking back up here. Oh, right, right. You come right. back here. Yeah, yeah. And I said, no, no. He wants to come back up here. I said, no, no. He's only a jumping. He's breathing off. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah. Uh huh. Good. So, 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 so it'll be Monday. If she can get to the archives on Monday, I'll come down with you. Yeah. Yeah, I know. But, but. Yeah. Yeah, that's, that's still a long, still a long way to go. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, yeah. No, but. I, yeah, next Thursday. So that's why I want to try and get something done before I go with the archives. I can go by myself. Uh, I, I can go to the archives myself and look on, on Monday. 
Yeah. Yeah. Okay. Okay. All right. All right. Well, that's my mate Morris. And I've told him I'm going to Philippines. He says, how long for? I says, well, I'm going there to get the tidal turbines going, however long that takes. I've got to be there to see it built. And then I've got to live with my uh, new family and get used to the area and, 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 and go and see the president, go and see a few people. Uh, and still uh, settle in there, and then we're coming back at Christmas time to New Zealand and see if she likes it. If I got the money, I should have had the money by then. But then I'll be coming back to kickstart the Cook Street uh, property, and this time I'll, I'll, I'll sue on it because I'll have the money to take him straight in the court and win. No one's going to lose, no one's going to win out of this lot. It's too much for anybody to put up with this flag if I got Duterte behind me with his gun, his machine guns. You see? They don't stand any nonsense with fraud. He hates fraud and I hate fraud too in this country. I'm going to rake them out one by one, including John Key. He's the biggest fraudster out in this whole world. He's got crime longer than young to deal with. So that's, uh, I've just um, written to Duterte and to the investor in Thailand, waiting for an answer, and I'll take it from there. Um, this is my last hurrah from New Zealand, and Puraho and uh, uh, Willie Peter rang me up, Puraho rang me up this morning, and um, Willie Peter yesterday, and I told him I'm going. I've got, to, I've got to go back on my trade in engineering. I've, I've done enough, as much as I can, to convince Mary where to go. But they're not listening. And with Kingi Todor, my old friend, well, sort of friend, uh, um, uh, struggling for life in uh, Middlemore Hospital. His family's there. But they kicked my daughter out. I'm not very happy about that. I'm not very happy about that. They didn't look after him. They didn't get him a house. They didn't get him a veteran fares. All his money's been spending all over the place and the boost the hell out of it and her. Uh, I saw all that. I saw all what he did and uh, he's, she's still stuck to him and she's asking me for advice and so what I'm, I'm, I'm doing is telling her what to do because I'm a legal man and law is my part of a profession in real estate and land and political issues. That's what I'm going to the Philippines for, to offer my services to the President. To put the turbines in the sea and get it going over there and show these Maoris and these stupid government here what the hell they missed out on because of their ignorance of me and what I've got to offer and they want it for their trustees. I'm going to boot those ones off my land. They're not even the owners, the real, real owners. They're just bullshit Maori, iwi, trustees that are just nothing but a myth. That's all. And the myth, I'm going to throw the myths into the court when I get money. Watch what happens with Moa's around. It's singing a tune at the moment in the United States with Daryl Payne over there. He's dishing it out. And it's very difficult without money. Money talks. But I'm telling him, look, I'm singing along on my pension. I'm going into Wynn's office tomorrow to tell them where I'm going, what I'm doing, and as long as I get my pension and hold it together for this country, I'll be going over to get support, outside support, to come back in and clean everybody out that's running full rack in the government. I'll tell you what, I'll run the whole fucking government myself. I don't need anybody to do anything because they are wasting money on useless decision making because they don't have titles. I've got it here. I've got it here. I'm taking it with me.
right? And I'll come back with the title and some reinforcement from Asia, including China if I go that far. But I'm going to Thailand and Philippines. Beautiful people. They are not ignorant like this lot of bastards, useless sods, <clears throat> all up themselves and milking the system, the people themselves. So that's all I want to say. I better get on with it and I do my work quickly myself. I'm just got my places in the mess at the moment because I'm pulling everything to bits, throwing away a lot of old stuff and putting my books away in storage so that they're all in seal and I've got till next Thursday to do it. Sell my car, sell a few little bits and pieces. I'll get what I want from the, but however, everybody's looking for a car, it's a Saab. It's got a warrant, a red zone, fresh warrant and red zone. And it goes good. Uh, might be a bit untidy on the inside, but I'll tell you what, she's a good car. And somebody give me 700 foot, it's yours. Okay, and uh, dive gear, um, fishing rods and things like that, I'll keep my drone and um, a few other things around the place. So there we go. I'll put everything in storage that I don't require and take off into the blue yonder to go to work with those skinny people in the Philippines. I never saw a fat one. They're all skinny because, you know, they work hard. They don't have benefits and handouts. No, they work. They grow their big trees. They eat it. And that island where my new wife is, they are self-sufficient. They have their own little shops, sell their own little things, make little money. That's all they're happy with, a simple life. That's where I'm going, to be a simple man with a simple woman. Death. Okay, I'm going to teach the kids how to run a big business and they can go for it. Okay, thank you very much. Bye. Have a nice evening. Today is Thursday, 17th of May 2018. Seven days left to go to fly out of New Zealand. Not forever, but to go and seek help outside because this useless mongrels here won't part with what they're stealing and share it. Now, I'm going to go and share it. All my experience with other people who are not ignorant. Okay, bye. Yeah.